Hello, this is Jose Coyol, Associate Planner with the City of Oxnard's Community Development Department in the Planning Division. Today I'll be narrating the following item for the Planning Commission held, being held on April 7, 2022. This project is for Banfield Pet Hospital Special Use Permit, Planning and Zoning Permit 21-520-04 for the location at 1950 North Rose Avenue with an APN of 213-0-100-065. Project Description. This is a request to allow the operation of a small animal veterinarian hospital. This component is without outdoor kennel, outdoor or indoor overnight boarding or overnight facilities except for medical observation only if trained medical staff are present during all times animals are on site. Intended improvements also consist of the following, the installation of new partition walls, minor plumbing upgrades and electrical upgrades. Animal veterinarian hospital operations will be conducted between the hours of 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. daily. Located within an existing 3,500 square foot tenant space of an approximately 15,400 square foot multi-tenant commercial building on a 2.2 acre site. <clears throat> this site is also located within a larger commercial shopping center consisting of approximately 52,000 square feet on a 7.87 acre site. The application was filed by Michelle Nidinger. Project location. The subject site is located at 1950 North Rose Avenue. As can be seen to the right within the vicinity map, this will be located on the northern part of the city, just south of US 101 along the Rose Avenue corridor. The general plan and zoning maps. General plan land use designation calls this as commercial general CG, while the zoning designation is general commercial C2. The existing site. The subject site at 1950 North Rose Avenue is surrounded by the following uses. At the actual project site, the zoning and general plan designations were mentioned previously and the existing land use configuration is multi-tenant shopping center. To the north, the zoning and general plan are retained and the existing land use is a fast food restaurant. To the south, the zoning changes to business research park known as BRP and a general plan designation of public semi-public PSP designation. The existing land use configuration is a St. John's Regional Hospital. To the east, the zoning retains as BRP and the general plan changes to BRP. The existing land use configuration is County of Ventura Behavioral Health Services Building. To the west, the zoning is General Commercial C2. The general plan is Commercial General and there is a gasoline fueling station with a convenience store. Existing conditions. This is a street view from the parking lot looking east. The new project, uh, Banfield Hospital, will be taking place over the existing, um, previously existing Chase um, storefront. Background, development history. On September 21st, 2000, the Planning Commission approved special use permit number 99-500-128 and tentative track map number 99-500-155 to authorize construction of an approximately 52,219 52, square foot commercial shopping center and associated site improvements on the project on the subject property. Requirement for a SUP. The Oxnard City Code section 16-135A22 related uses requires a special use permit for small animal veterinarian hospitals serving common household pets provided that no outdoor kennels are permitted. Site plan. As can be seen in the site plan, the Banfield Pet Hospital will be located within an existing building and it will be mainly a TI improvement, a tenant improvement. There will be no changes to the exterior as part of this project. Floor plan. As can be seen on here, there will be substantial partitioning of walls to go ahead and create spaces for examination rooms, laboratories, um, and procedure areas, as well as places to go ahead and store the household pets, as well as for employees to conduct various uh, veterinarian um, operations, as well as um, break rooms and that sort of thing. Public comments. On December 9, 2021, this, the site was posted with project details and com community workshop information and the developer mailed out 1,054 meeting agenda notices to the residents of the East Village neighborhood. 
On December 20th, 2021, the project was presented to the public during a community workshop meeting. The meeting was attended by approximately 18 members of the public and persons had an opportunity to ask questions. Staff did not receive any comments during the workshop. To date, staff has not received any public comments regarding this project. Key conditions of approval, operating restriction conditions. Conditions 21, prohibit outdoor, indoor, overnight boarding of animals at the site to be a compatible neighbor with other general commercial uses. Boarding of animals shall occur indoors within tenant space during open business hours. Animals may be kept indoors overnight for medical observation only if trained medical staff are present during all times animals are on site. Finally, development improvement condition. Condition 22, requires site improvements based on requirements by the American with Disabilities Act, known as ADA. Environmental review. In accordance with Section 15301, Class 1, existing facilities of the State of California's Environmental Quality Act, known as CEQA, guidelines projects involving negligible or no expansion of use beyond that existing at the time of the lead agency's determination may be found to be exempt from the requirements of CEQA. Thus, the project includes a request for the oper to operate a small animal veterinarian hospital facility within an existing individual building. The project will not increase the square footage of the existing building. No substantial evidence the project will have significant effect on the environment. A notice of exception, exemption is recommended to be filed. Staff's recommendation that the Planning Commission A. Find the project to be categorically exempt from environmental review pursuant to the California Environmental Quality Act, known as CEQA, guideline sections 15301 existing facilities, and B. Adopt resolution 2022-XX approving planning and zoning permit number 21-520-04, special use permit, subject to certain findings and conditions. This concludes staff's presentation of the upcoming item for the Planning Commission hearing on April 7, 2022. Staff will be available to, to answer any further questions regarding this project request. Thank you.